If your lawn started looking brown and damaged weeks ago, it's likely got nothing to do with the change of the seasons. An army has invaded Metro Atlanta. Not a real army, but army worms are more prevalent than any time in recent years. But why? Here's our why guy, all new this morning. It has been the perfect storm, powerful enough to unleash an army. Portions of the South are suffering through a massive invasion of fall army worms. One of the worst invasions in decades may be the result of storms. The more rain means more less green, so more food available for them. And they just go, you know, they're crazy with that. Army worms devour lawns and crops. Let's look at some of the possible reasons why they're causing more problems than usual this year. Army worms are actually caterpillars that become moths, then travel across the country. UGA entomologist Dr. Shemat Joseph says this year the moths begin traveling earlier than usual, allowing them more time to settle, lay eggs, and produce their army. So the weather pattern might have helped. The weather current, hot air, cold air, all those things can suck up these moths. Pick them up and carry them to a new home. Tropical storms and hurricanes will do that. There's been no shortage of tropical systems this year. The South has seen above average rainfall, helping grass grow, encouraging army worms to eat and reproduce. They can uh, clearly wipe out uh, a lawn from green to brown within a couple of days. A single moth can lay thousands of eggs at a time, producing an army all on her own. The good news is that army worms typically can't survive a Georgia winter. Dr. Joseph says their numbers should begin to dwindle before Thanksgiving. 